Hey, Peter Buswell for drboip.com. Today we're going to take a look uh, at configuring selective recording in the Calabria or Cisco Workforce Optimization Server. So sometimes you just want to uh, record folks, that push a record button. And I'll show you how to get that set up here. Basically, you have to set those phones up uh, the way you would for any other phone. So um, there's some other video clips that we've done on how to set up recording in your call manager to enable uh, Collaborate or Cisco Workforce uh, Optimization Recording, or Compliance Recording. Take a look at that, but you're basically going to take the same steps. The difference here is twofold. One, you're going to create an exclusion list. So in the server uh, settings, you, under inclusion list, you're going to set up an exclusion list and list the phones in there that you don't want to record. Set them to any. And then you're going to create a phone XML service and subscribe those phones to that service. So let's log in and take a look at this and I'll show you how it's done. So inside the workforce uh, optimization server, the Collaborative server, you have to do this on the server. Uh, the phones you want to record have to be part of the, uh, um, the VoIP devices if you're doing network recording. The difference here is you're going to go into the inclusion list. In the inclusion list, basically there are two, it's actually an inclusion and exclusion. So on the inclusion side, we're saying record anything. Uh, you, you can create different filters uh, to set up recording. Here in the exclusion area, we're going to say uh, um, we want to exclude these phones from being recorded. and. I'll point out that you can set that for extension calls, calling numbers, call numbers. We're going to set it for any. So that means don't, don't record this phone at all. And uh, once that's uh, set up, then you are, um, let's go ahead and log into the call manager. Okay, once you log into the call manager, go to device, device settings, and then phone services. Yeah, and you'll add a new service. I've already set it up here. You can call it anything you want. But uh, the basic configuration is to point, give it a name, give it a description. The description could be anything uh, you want to give it. Here's um, the link to the API on the Calabrio server. So. HTTP, your server IP address, recording controls slash IPP slash main. Go ahead and set your category to XML service. And then go ahead and set your standard IP phone service. And of course, you're going to have to go into each of your phones and uh, subscribe them. So go find the phones that you uh, want to include in your um, selective recording service and <clears throat> at that point you're going to go here and subscribe unsubscribe services you're going to go of course and subscribe to uh, the recording service that you just set up and once that appears if you uh, bring up um, your phone, I'll use a, a communicator here that uh, <clears throat> has previously been configured. Um, so I've got my extension configured. And when you go to services, you should see the service that you previously set up. Go ahead and select it. And at that point, the beauty of using the service is that um, you now have the ability to record, pause, resume, delete, uh, start, stop your recordings. So if you have an active phone call, just go ahead and hit the record button. You can pause it. 
you can resume it. It's uh, quite cool, and uh, it's one of the benefits of using this as an XML service. Now, you can use the same EP API to build this into Finesse, and we'll do another clip and show you how to put this in Finesse. Hope you have found this informative. Uh, thank you for viewing. Please uh, subscribe.